let's talk about the tragic death of Sana Dart, aka the raw vegan food chef. By now, all of you have heard about the tragic news of her death. I want to start off this video by saying that I'm really pissed off at certain people. I don't like to use language during my videos, but this has crossed the line. But before we dive into that, I would express my deepest condolences to all her family and loved ones. Thoughts and prayers to all of them. So why am I making this video this late? As of this recording, her cause of death is unclear. Some will say her cause of death was due to starvation and others will tell you that it was cholera. And others, and this is why I'm so pissed off, will use her death to suit their own biases and tell you that it was the diet. If you don't know the cause of death, you don't know the cause of death. It's not rocket science. And if we don't know something, we are assuming something. And if you are assuming something, we get into a territory which can be very dangerous. Assumptions equal a loss of pride and stink of defeat. One of those posts, alongside many others of the carnivore community that pissed me off, was the post of Dr. Sean Baker. So all these carnivore people have, according to the latest evidence that we have so far, are anecdotes and assumptions. And they use other people's staff to suit their bias. This is not okay. It would be the equivalent of me taking, for example, Joe Lindner's passing, aka Joe Statics, and contributing his staff to his consumption of meat. This doesn't make any sense, and nor should it. All of you that have used her death to suit your bias, you should be ashamed of yourselves. And by the way, if you want to assume something, it was probably the cholera infection. Cholera is an infection that requires immediate treatment, because you're losing tons of fluids through either diarrhea, or vomiting. And that loss of fluid can lead to dehydration. But whether her cause of death was due to starvation, the cholera infection, or maybe both, or maybe something else, we don't know. Please, don't use her death in order to suit your bias. If you're doing that, then you should be ashamed of yourself. What are your thoughts about this topic? Feel free to let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching, as always, and I'll see you all during my next post.